He lied about how great he was on crime. I had to remind him that he oversaw a record increase in murder rates in 2020. On my watch, violent crime is hit a 50-year low. There's more to do than 50-year low. And then I pointed out that the only convicted criminal on the stage last night was Donald Trump. <laughs> when I thought about his 34 felony convictions, his sexual assault on a woman in a public place, his being fined $400 million for business fraud, I thought to myself, Donald Trump isn't just a convicted felon. Donald Trump is a one-man crime wave. <laughs> He's got more trials. He's got more trials coming up. Look, the thing that bothers me maybe most about him, he has no respect for women or the law. He doesn't. And then his biggest lie. He lied about how he had nothing to do with the insurrection of January 6th. We all saw it with our own eyes. We watched it on television. We saw thousands of his direction attack the Capitol. We saw police being attacked, the Capitol being ransacked, the mob hunting for Speaker Pelosi, gallows literally set up for Mike Pence. And then he told him as he sat in the dining room, one, one the private dining room, one door off my Oval Office. He sat there for three hours watching the TV. He did not a single thing to stop it. Nothing. Nothing at all. And now, and now he wants to pardon all those convicted and. Uh,